despite the name, Rhode Island is not known for the excellent condition of its roads. The state leader has created a fund that would help cities and towns finance bridge and street repair projects. More than a dozen communities applied before last week's deadline, requesting a total of $29 million. From the Providence Global Newsroom, Eyewitness News reporter Mara Kennedy is in East Providence. It's been a few years since East Providence has been able to repair an entire street. Commercial Way is one of the busier streets here, and they're hoping to have it repaired if they're granted the funds. Over the last few years, East Providence Department of Public Works has been filling in a lot of potholes. Here in East Providence, we have a uh, fair number of roadways. We are, we're responsible for 160, 160 miles of roads throughout the city, um, many of which now have reached our have poor condition. To repair the roadways, it could cost half a million dollars or more. Money that the Public Works Department doesn't have. But for the first time in his 15 years in East Providence, that may change. We uh, received a notice from the state DOT that uh, they will bring together this fund for municipalities as a loan program. Department of Transportation is prioritizing the needs of applicants and are granting $7 million total in hopes of economic growth throughout the state. East Providence is one of 13 municipalities that require money asking for 1.5 million dollars. Pawtucket Department of Public Works requested all seven million dollars. We were very aggressive in what we were looking to do because we feel we have such a, a strong need here in the city. The state is expected to make a decision by the beginning of 2014. Reporting with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Mark Kennedy, Eyewitness News.